happening? He will tell you exactly what's happening. Right, so we're at the bus graveyard. It's an old favourite of mine over the years. We're going to be chatting a little bit quieter just because of the location that water is. Technically, these buses are and aren't abandoned. It's a bit of a grey area. The yeah. guy still owns it, still works here, still does stuff. So there's parts, some of these buses are actually preservation buses and might get yeah. restored one day. So if you do come here, be respectful. Anyway, that's enough of the politics. Buses. <laughs> God, when's the last time you've seen a little LDV shape of Anna Gaden? Been a couple of years, haven't I? <laughs> they used to rest out back in the day, never mind yeah. now after all these years. What's she like inside? Well, she's got leaves in her. And she's got seats in her. Look at the cages and a saw as well. That looks more like a prison bus than a school bus with all sorts of crazy. Unless that's literally just where the luggage went. But what's attracting my attention now is this year. If you come here as well, boys and girls, yes, you can get on the buses, but... Uh, just close the doors and stuff after you just to respect them a little bit but yeah here we go how cool is this very very cool location and that's how different the rules were back then as well look seat in 31 stand in 12 so we've paid our fare thank you drive look at this all the old clocks and the old dials on there as well the old buttons Right through to the engine. The old diesel motor right there. Literally right there. Oh fan there as well. Don't forget this is before the days of air conditioning, isn't it? I can see the engine. The <laughs> coins in there as well. How cool is this? Your first time, yeah. What's your thoughts? This is awesome, isn't it? It's very, very cool. Optar lot. These buses are all the Optar buses. This is cool as well. I love that. The patina on them. And as we come through here as well, I want to show you this old Bedford. I love that. I can actually still remember those on the road in the 90s, to be honest with you. This one as well. Look at this. It's cool, isn't it? It is, isn't it? There's another little optar there if you want to go and have a little look on the it. Swans as well. And the swans. Call a vet because these swans are sick. Literally. And as we go on board this one, very similar sort of layer. Looks like it's been a cat or a dog or something in there. Oh, it's something. With the paw prints, yeah. but uh, automatic transmission over there as well. It's in first. This is cool as well. This is all the seats. See, this one's on the seat in 25, stand in seven. See? Oh, yeah. I've got to wash this water getting in through the sky vent on this. And uh, yeah, I do love this place. So, so as we go through the trees, it has changed a lot over the years in here as well. We've got another big one here. Is this? Do you want to take them on board? This one, I'm going to take a couple of photos. Hey, buddy. I can't tell you much other than uh, this is a bus. Oh, it's a nice bus, mine, doesn't it? Look, things are still intact. Look, vehicle defect report. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm assuming in case of emergency, masks come down from the sky, you know? Last time this was taxed was 2006. 2006. But this reminds you very much of coaches used to go on school trips back in the day. Now you can see there, the floor is possibly going to not be as good. So let's leave that one out of it. But this, kilometers. that's not much for a bus. God, that's a shaft. Man. That's a knob mine, isn't it? Back there. But yeah, look at this, this is great. Very, very This cool. is like a, a control centre for a power station or something. It's good. Well, the thing is with buses, isn't it? You literally just have a little look at it, don't you, when you walk it on them or whatever. But I ride a bus very often, I'll Ooh. be honest. Ooh. Nil standing. Nil standing. Nil standing. Nil standing. It must be never. Nil standing. There we go. But yeah, there's buses back and forth with them as well. Up top there. This is very cool to see. There's more buses out the front as well. We're gonna try and show you some of the ones we can see in here. Because this was an old service station as well, an old petrol station. Jones Travel, see? Now this bus was from Merthyr Tidville. I can remember the Jones Travel back in the day. A lot of these Optar ones. Hell of a lot of these Optar ones. Look at the bends with this kit on it as well. Oh, yeah, the body kit, that's good kit on a bed. Cool that is, isn't it? Let's uh, just take a little picture of that there. But yeah, this old ERF wrecker used to be out the front. So it's been moved inside as well. 
What gets me though as well, like buses can sit for like 10, 15, 20 years. It really don't take a lot Are to get them Morris? going. Are you having trouble moving? Come this way. <laughs> we got Morris lubricants inside. <laughs> See, this is the problem though. Someone has probably put this through the window. Smashing. Yeah, like, and it's, it's not good, like. Cranking. It's not good. So these are the famous ones. These are the buses for what this location was known for, especially the Macau one there, but also the Scouts Guides one here. Okay. Stunning buses. The colours of these, the patina on them. Excellent. As we keep walking through. Awesome, I love this. There's a chassis of something there, and that's obviously a truck of some sort. But yeah, we've seen about the patina on these guys, all the moss. Now that old LDV van here. Excellent, isn't it? Oh, that looks like an old folder or a very old ERF or something. Yeah. Excellent. To be fair, that's not in bad nick, is it? Not in bad nick at all. Look at that. I'll just close that. Awesome. Locked. Give you a hand. I give you, unless you want to do a couple of cinematics. Then I'll make some pieces. I didn't know there was this much in you. It is very surprising, what's in there. It is very surprising. Them tyres have seen better days, mind, haven't they? The cords have come through and they're rusting, that's awesome. <laughs> but yeah, man, it's a shame to see all these here. I mean, is he using them as parts, parts vehicles? Maybe, I don't know. But um, yeah, if you come here, and we're not suggesting you come here, don't damage anything, there's no need for it. We're very much old school over back, so. Scouts and guides. Slammed the driver's head through the uh, <laughs> the windscreen, and we've got headlights that look like speakers. Stunning. Yo, this Benz is actually really nice. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Do you want to see as you're inside? Yeah. I can Oi, do. nil standing in this one, too, sir. I'm sorry. Stick with me for my standing. Oh, must be more. This is a new one. Yeah, this is cool, isn't it? Love this. The motor there. Yeah, I'll have a gear stick on him as well, mind, isn't it? Obviously, it's gonna have to because of the distance there. But uh, what's the miles on this? The miles on this look like it's 558,000. Which, fair play, it's been around the block or two. And what I can do when I go through here as well, I'll show you some of the ones. See, this is the problem we have here, people vandalizing things. I don't agree with it. Really, really don't agree with it. But this is the prime place to take a photo of this. Lovely. Here Ooh. we go. Oh, there we are. Look, we're going through the window shop. Yeah, he's taking photos on the bus. Let's go over here. But yeah, this is good. And then it's got like um, like a bit of a body kit on it. Interesting things. Ooh, 24 hour recovery. Well, well, well. These have seen better days. Heartbeat. Heartbeat. <laughs> Other old programs are available. It's cool, isn't it? It's got to be 60s, isn't it? Oh, made of wood. Camper van, this would be converted to, look. Well, partly, isn't it? It's got a saloon door so you can go downstairs there. And these, for example, that sort of stuff like would have taken the miners and the miner strikes ah. back in the day, you know? Yeah, you're absolutely right, yeah. Definitely. But I can remember years ago, when I did this location, must have been around about 2015, 16. Put pictures up of it online before it was everywhere. That bus on the end, the boy actually got in touch and says he owns it. <laughs> and he's hoping to get it, obviously, produced at some point. But almost a decade on, it's still sat Good luck here. with that. Yeah. So believe it or not, this location is literally at the side of a main road. See, these are new. There's new stuff arriving all the time. It's been cleaned up here as well. There's works going on. But here's the old service station. Let's be honest, we all wish the fuel was still that right? Four star as well. God, it's going back in the day, isn't it? So as you walk through the old service station, look at that caravan is new as well. There's a lot of newer stuff here. Storm Petroleum. It's cool, isn't it? Yeah. Locked on here. 
Can you fill her up, please? The 45 on number one. See, this is how you know we're still active, because this truck, I believe, is quite new. The old red one as well, greyhound as well. Awesome. Toilets. We ain't kidding. Oh, it'd be rude to come this far and not go the whole way, wouldn't it? A toilet that's not actually smashed up for a change. So as we venture on through, what you guys back home are missing is the actual smell of damp. This year is very surprising. Just to give you a little hidden look, there's actually some buses in the workshop also. This place is full of buses. And yeah, let's have a little venture through. A little high chair there. Wow. Mossy carpet. I was going to say, this is very damp in here. The smell. So we've got a front of house here, full of seats and storage. You have to remember, boys and girls, this would have been a service station. Sorry, I know it is a little bit dark. Let's keep on going through. Oh, the smell. I love that smell. Just that it's damp, right, musky good. smell. I'm guessing that's a Volvo. Potentially could be a Volvo, you might be right. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, wow. Also, I think walking up downstairs. Ah, there's steps to nowhere, like this There's going. steps to nowhere, yeah. Yeah, I did it. Go on, I'll do have a nose. Oh, you're welcome, go on. I did these a couple of years ago. I don't know if they're still solid, but we'll have a look. You see wood. Oh, it's left, eh? Oh, they're damp as well, they are. Oh, yeah. Oh, that one too, something. Yeah, I'm moving his right. Just to give you a little... Uh, look, there's nothing actually up here. But I risked it all for you. That risk has to be worth a like on this video. Oh yeah, I've not already it's set up to us, isn't it? It's not just something we say for fun, like it actually helps us. And it doesn't cost you anything. Do you know what I'm saying? You can give us a sub, you can give us a like, you can leave a comment. All these things do actually help the channel grow. Don't cost you nothing. I'm loving this stereo as well. Alba. Alba, that's all it's time. What's that, in the 90s? Yo, have you heard? Herds of Bitterford. It's crazy that this is just out the side of the road. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Another brown. It's blowing my mind all the changes in buses over the years, too. Westlink. Westlink, yo. That'll be the Volvo we saw from inside. Yeah, they're on the private property, aren't they? But this mm. Yeah, seems structurally solid. Ah. Every time. So, we know everybody's been here and done this in the past. He's been here and done it loads many, of times. Many, many times. But it's never been on our channel before, has it? So Plus, it's still documenting the aging and decay. Oh, yeah, these things, things and happen and change all the time. And it's still changing all the time. But mm. as I said, if you do come here, respect it. That's the only thing we have. Don't vandalise it. 100%. Don't steal nothing. Also, a little uh, Easter egg for people who've watched the video this far. Right next to the pumps. Yeah, man, we got a Banksy. Banksy video coming soon. Stay tuned. Yeah, what are we saying? Until next time? Until next time, thank you very much.